After more than a year, Aminu Kado is back home. Aminu, his two wives and 11 children fled Aono in 2015 when Boko Haram militants took control of the town. They're among thousands who sought refuge in Maiduguri. Their house and farmlands have been destroyed, their livestock slaughtered. I used to be comfortable enough to take care of my family. I'd travel to the city to buy goods and bring them back here to sell. We had animals too, goats, cows, chickens. Although the Kado family is pleased to be back in Aono, it's not easy. This tent is home, at least for the time being. Boko Haram has really set us back. I've had to find work, any work, to get money to feed my family and myself. Like Aminu, millions of Nigerians fled their homes during the seven-year Boko Haram insurgency. Now that the military has recorded success in its offensive, many lost territories have been recovered. But it's going to take a great deal to rebuild towns like Aonu. Local government areas have been seriously devastated by Boko Haram. And uh, so uh, a lot of the resources of the state uh, are being injected into this uh, local governments to make sure that uh, the, uh, the, the, the rebuilding process is expedited and, and speeded up. The militants are still carrying out attacks in northeastern Nigeria and neighboring countries. Authorities estimate at least 20,000 people have been killed since 2007 and millions displaced from their homes. Kelechi Amekalam, CCTV Abuja, Nigeria.